Okay, guys, welcome back to the channel. Should be wearing a cowboy hat based on the title of this video. Well, you don't even know yet. If you want to listen, I titled it the song of the year on my Geo Research and Extremes. And if you just want to get to that, hearing this song on my Geo Research and Extremes, I'll put a chapter. You can go straight to that. But what I wanted to do before I showed you that is explain why and kind of some macro takeaways that parlay back to this weekend and why I should be wearing a cowboy hat. Although that's all I did this past weekend because I was in Fredericksburg, which is the town, small town in Texas, where I bought some property to build an Airbnb. It's big. It's like the Napa of the South. It's got lots of live music, culture, ranching. The property I bought is Archway Resort. It has a winery, distillery, brewery, this amphitheater where Scott Stapp of Creed, this was the grand opening, the official grand opening of the property. And he kicked it off, and that was great. But what I also featured, especially on my Instagram and stuff, was the town of Fredericksburg is so much different than what I'm used to in Houston. Big city life, the fancy clubs and restaurants. And that's fun in some respects, but it gets tiring. It's a little superficial. What I like to do is go to Fredericksburg to detach. And it's so refreshing to go down Main Street, Street and hear live music at night in almost any, every venue instead of DJs. And the crowd is not the pretentious, uh, picture-taking, you know, type of people. Uh, they're all fun-loving, lots of bachelorette parties, girls' weekends, guys' weekends, um, and people are very friendly. So, and all wearing cowboy hats. Uh, but it parlays into why I chose the song that I did, because I encountered a song that I had never heard before. And it's the song Save Me by Jelly Roll. And what happened was, let me give you the background. I was in a karaoke bar, which is also fun. Not only the live music in Fredericksburg, but they have a great karaoke bar where a lot of people get up and sing country music, which is cool from two respects. It's different than I'm used to, but also the lyrics to country songs when you see them on the screen and they're singing them, they're a lot more fun to sing along with, guys. It's really fun. I'll even play one. Maybe I'll put it in a YouTube short because it'll probably get my video banned, but it's so cool. It's the WAP of country, country music. You got to hear this song. Anyway, uh, what I was hearing a legitimate song that made me stop in my tracks. I know there's a lot of videos on YouTube that are reaction videos. I wish I would have had the camera on me while I was at this karaoke bar. I was talking to some people at the couch we were on, and all of a sudden I heard this voice singing, and it was far better than normal karaoke. So I immediately stood up, grabbed my camera, and started filming. And I think I have, I might have put that on the channel. I know on Instagram I did and, and Facebook. But uh, this girl, Sarah, was singing a song. And then when I started looking at the lyrics, the combination of her voice, the passionate lyrics, how she was singing them, I was like, I've never even heard this song before. It's incredible. Who is this? So I immediately later that night, it was like 3 or 4 a.m. when I got home. And I started researching this song. I was so into what the hell was that song. And it was Save Me uh, by Jelly Roll. And again, song I'd never heard before. But what it kind of parlays into is a macro takeaway I wanted to talk about. Bigger than just song of the year on Geo Research and Extremes. Like I said, you want to hear that? I got a chapter. Just go straight to that. But in this hobby, one of the things that make this hobby great is that Unlike other hobbies, it can really pay off more than just the gear itself, the eye candy. When you hear a song, whether it's this song or any other song that you think is your song of the year, this hobby can give you goosebumps, can make the hair on the back of your head stand up. That's what it really did when I heard this song. And then when I watched on YouTube him sing it, I was like, this is why I'm in the hobby. It's not for the gear. It's for the ability of this gear to create that kind of reaction in you. I mean, other than sex and, you know, other what other things can give you that kind of um, adrenaline rush and, and impact to your emotion? In some cases, I'm sure people that hear this song, it touches them on a level that would probably even make them cry. I bet you if you watch some of these reaction videos, I bet you there's one on this video, this song, and I'm sure that this touches people on an emotional level. And what stood out to me when I watched Jelly Roll sing it is I knew immediately that this applied to his life. It was a song that you could tell from the first note sometimes whether somebody is singing it based on somebody else writing it and whether it touches them. Just the length of how they hold the notes. It's just a subliminal intuition you can feel. At least I got that impression from 
this song that stood out. And actually, on this thing, I'm going to actually give you a contrast. Chris Stapleton, um, starting over. Great song. Phenomenal song. I think it should be in one of my favorites of the year. But there's a definite difference between him singing that and the passion I got from that and Jelly Roll singing Save Me. That That's why I elevated Save Me. And as a macro point on top of all that is country music. I mean, I'm also going to put in this video um, uh, Keith Greninger's Looking for a Home. That was played in the Odyssey Room at Capitol Audio Fest, if you watch that video. There, and Chris Stapleton has played now. Country music is overlooked, probably, and gets a bad rap. People say, oh, I like everything except country. Think about that. I used to be guilty of that as well. If you think about it, the current music that's coming out now, they're the only genre that's actually playing instruments anymore and not doing as much lip syncing and choreography and fluff um, and compression and all this stuff. They're a very good quality country song. So my New Year's resolution actually is to put country music back on the map at audiophile shows. And what I did with this video in the clips, I got my song of the year, the Save Me by Jelly Roll, but then I put some other country music clips that I think if you're a manufacturer having a room, you ought to put these on your list. I think they will resonate with people every bit, if not more, than the tired old gimmicky tracks. I mean, we have so many people in this hobby. And again, you can do audiophile however you want. But there's, I encounter so many people that listen to three or four tracks. If you ask them what to play on the system, uh, they have to look it up. You know, they don't know right off the bat. Um, that's fine. Again, whatever makes you enjoy your system is all up to you. You can listen to the same song nonstop. I don't care. It doesn't hurt me any. But I think what will take you to enjoying your system even more and finding the hobby more rewarding is when you can play anything on it and you can play, more importantly, whatever you like, whatever does make the hair on the back of your head uh, stand up, gives you that emotional attachment. So it's not so much about recognizing this song as, yes, for me, stood out as the song of the year for me. Uh, it may not have the best audio file metrics or recording quality, all those other things. But for me, made me stand up and say, this is a brilliant song, uh, regardless of genre or any prejudices. And really the macro takeaway for you is, Find those songs that do that. Make sure your system can do that well, because that's where this hobby pays off. When you can get emotion out of it, it's better than watches and fancy cars. Well, I guess a fancy car, if you actually use a Ferrari to go the speed that it does, most people just use it, leave it in their garage or never even test the capabilities of these fancy cars that they have. But this is where you can get that adrenaline rush and the powerful emotional attachment to your hobby. And that's when these prices pay off. Otherwise, for me, if you're just churning gear and listening to the same songs over and over, I don't see how that equation balances out in your favor in terms of getting your money's worth. But again, you do you. I'm just showing you and wanted to highlight why I'm picking this song and some of the macro takeaways, as well as my New Year's resolution. Country is coming to audiophile shows in 2024. All right, guys, enjoy this clip. Shattered my hopes and my dreams I'm 
What do I do? Oh, what do I do? I get fucked up just cause I'm scared Love's just another drug I have grown a victim to So what do I do? Give my goddamn records in my clothes back Cause I'm feeling Of the peace, 
Won't you leave me alone? Never hurt nobody. I'm just looking for a phone. On the day I was born, all my mama did was cry. It was the day my daddy left with no goodbye. The snow was falling. On my birth and day I swear the tears of my sweet mama Never went away And I've been down once I've been down twice I've been down so many times In my life Miss the justice of the peace won't you leave me alone? Never hurt nobody. I'm just looking for a no. Spent the last few weeks in a small town jail. I'm counting nobody that could post my bail. I asked the sheriff, man, he tell me what I done. He just turns away and says with a smile, hey, I think of something, son. Well, I've been down one I've been down twice I've been down so many times In my life Miss the justice of the peace Won't you leave me alone Never hurt nobody Just looking for a home Judged by these clothes on my back Or the lines cross my face But until that time I move from town to town And pray the Lord give me strength When the winter time comes around Cause I've been down once I've been down twice I've been down so many times in my life, Miss the Justice of the Peace. Won't you leave me alone? I never hurt nobody. I'm just looking for a home. And Miss the Justice of the Peace. Won't you leave me alone? I ain't never hurt nobody. Just looking for my